Yeah, it was a long flight. Yeah. Don't worry, sir. I will have the documents on your desk first thing in the morning. Okay, good. Unless I go too crazy at Shadow tonight. <laughs> oh my god. Yep, yeah, no. I'm sorry, sir. You're right. It's not funny when I say it. No, sir. I didn't tell anybody about what you did. I'm sorry. No, of course. Okay. Right. I'm sorry. Okay. Good night, sir. Good night. Ooh, mints. How do the stars look tonight? Beautiful, as always. And how art thou? Did you make a deal? I'm getting there. China is riding my ass. But I have the Stevenson documents in my bag. I've heard enough. You need a boy's night. And luckily I know the perfect bistro. You know the beast cannot sleep unless he is feast. Hey, buddy, enlighten me. Who quoteth that? That was the bard himself, Maurice Sendak. Ha <laughs> ha! There goes my genius roommate yet again. I'm gonna go get ready. Tonight, I'm not gonna think about work at all. Buddy, uh, I think you're forgetting junior associate with that. Do you have my fish? Yeah, I've got a fish. Wait, how'd you get this number? What's going on? Bring my suitcase to the man cave in one hour. Come alone, and we'll make an exchange. An exchange? What are you talking about? Hey, hey do you have my bag? There are documents in there! Hello? Hello? Oh, fuck. Oh. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Alex. That was abuse! What the hell have you gotten yourself into? The Stevenson documents. I'm so hey, fucked. No! Look at me! Look at me! Hey! It's gonna be okay! You are having a panic attack! Look at me! Breathe! I, breathe! I can't, Look at me! I can't, breathe! You are having a panic attack! You are having a panic attack! I can't breathe! I can't breathe! Oh my god! The Stevenson documents! I'm so fucked! Need, what do you need? I need, I need China! I'm so fucked! China! What do you need? I need those documents! I I need this job! I need this job! Oh my god! I need your car! I need your car! Or this whole merger falls apart! I need this job! It's fine. I can do this. I can do this. I am so glad that you said that because I am so unbelievably scared right now. That's the signal. Are you ready? Yeah. Uh, hello? Can we please make this quick? We have reservations at a bistro. What do you mean you don't have the fish? I fucked up. Fucked up? How? You don't need to know all the details. It's a pretty long story, actually. But just know that I, I fucked up. I really did. Tell me exactly what happened. Well, um, 
I don't get out that much ever since I started working for you. So when I had the opportunity to go pick up the shipment from the airport, it's kind of a big deal for me. I've lived here my whole life, and I feel like I've never really seen the real New York City. You read about New York in the books, but no words can truly capture this magnificent place. Wait, what's that sound? Do you hear that? Yup, it's the hustle and bustle of a city that never stops. And I wouldn't want it any other way. Eight billion different people, all living out their own stories. And caught in the middle of it all, one me. I'm starting to like this crazy town. And something tells me it's starting to like me too. Um, but I mean, you know, at the end of the day, I, I, I had a job to do. I was taking it very seriously. So I hopped on the world famous New York City subway to get to the world famous LaGuardia Airport. And sure enough, one foot after the other, I found my way in. But uh, before I got the bag, something called to me. It was a, a sign. I mean, an, an awesome ass sign with a big heart, but it was a sign. And there was a mix up. Um, but I'm going to fix it. I, I am fixing it. Just don't get mad, please. Why aren't you saying anything? Dinner service starts in 30 minutes, and you're telling me we have no fish, no protein. People come here for the purple fish. How can you possibly fix this in 30 minutes? You ruined it. Grandpa, I love you. Oh, don't grandpa me. I know what you're trying to do. Your father did the same thing to me, and I put him to the curb. I put my ass on the line for you. For this restaurant. People come to this restaurant for the purple fish, not for you. Sunday dinner at Slappy's is an institution. There is no Slappy's without the purple fish. But please, go on. Tell me all you do for this restaurant. Where do you think you're going? I'm gonna do my job. Slappy's family restaurant my ass. I mean, a junior associate blowing the merger does not exactly reflect well on the firm. I'm gonna lose my job. We will worry about that tomorrow, but for tonight, we will break bread. And it's not like we can go to the police either. Um, let's just say that the Stevenson documents aren't exactly above board. I swear to God, if I ever see that guy again, I'm gonna kill him. Doesn't he know not to mess with a Carnegie Mellon man? <laughs> Great. And now my best friend isn't even paying attention to me. Your face you back. shot at me, you piece of shit! I'm just a kid with cancer. I'm You're not a kid with cancer, I'm you have a mustache! I'm 16! You are not 16 I'm years old! Okay, I'm 14! You're not, but that's I'm even younger! Are Where are my documents? And who yeah. do you work for? Do you work for China? It works for me! That is my grandson. This is my restaurant. I am the chef. I love my grandson. 
And you, you, this is a suitcase. And you, you wearing a suit. And this guy, I like this guy. Anyway, I believe this suitcase is yours. And I believe you have our purple fishy friend. Now what say I cook up this fucker and show you what this whole mess is all about? Dinner is served.